Whew, right, hooty hoo indeed there, BBPN and of course on a guess, yep, season of the open bar, as always, panders on, carries on, I, it's something like that. So, let's see what Constable Williams has brought us. And there we go. Yep, you see it. Havling Chef, nothing. Must be fucking bizarre these days. <laughs> Worst chef ever. Yep, there we go. 0 for 3. Ah, that's a great fucking start. Zero. Again. It is the legend. Might be the legend, but certainly not the chef. Yep, the chef absolutely flummoxes it. So, yep, it's your stars and your favorites, the ogres, up here against. I, got bribes in the in the I don't know. But yep, someone's got elven turf, so is that a great thing? I don't know. Could be. Could be. Could be defective. I don't know. Uh, the glass, let's face it, was the most deadly thing against the Wood Elves last game. So we'll see how this one actually does turn out. But, yep, yeah, it's the most fragile lizards and luggage you have seen all season. Yep, yeah, these Saurus is notorious, including that. Yeah, you can see it, he's already down one again. Uh, he's always fucking down one, it seems to be this season. Yeah, it's happened all season. He's been down players every single game, it seems like. But... Does have a bunch of skinks, has the star, we'll see how he performs, and there we go, solid kick, let's get out, oh, never mind. Yep, there we go, the ogres get a blitz, because of course they do, and we're off and running already, this, there's so many ways this can go wrong, alright, here we go, solid hit, solid push, solid nothing, alright, are we throwing the normal down the field, yes, load the cannon lads, there we go, Ch chink, there we go. Grass grows, birds fly, sun shines, and brother, I hurt people. Well, that didn't work the way it was supposed to, was it? No, that didn't work at all. All right, well, that's a failed throw, teammate. We get ripped. Well, so much for elven grass, eh? How much could thump indeed? Oh, oh well, better settle back now with a couple of beers. This could be one of those interesting games again. Woo! Work complete. Well, Sauruses did come out hitting this time. Thick Skull saves the ogre for once. As you can see, he is fielding a nice little plethora of ogres, and he does have a full roster of Norblers today. So, it is the full staff that's showing up for this game here. A must win, both firms. No, really, in this division, both these firms need to win this game because, well, they're down so many points. They really need to start putting some wins on the board here. So, because let's face it, if they're going to qualify, they got to have a better record. Especially in this division. Speaking of, easy peasy, halfly squeezy. He's got the calico there. He's off and moving in. Now the ogres, normally I would say this is fine. But you've seen the ogres, not afraid to throw the ball. Meanwhile, here we go, sneaky. Oh, really? We're going to go stop on a nobbler. Oh, yeah, that's brave. Did you get him? Nope. Leak is only stunned, apparently. Brave, brave, brave. Foolish, but brave. All right, there we go. Solid hit, the juggernaut. Ooh. Time for a true display of skill. Well, there we go. The carnage has definitely begun. There we go. First Gucci handbag of the day. Sign stealed and delivered. What do you mean, do they have a bribe? No, why would you have a bribe? What do you need bribes for? You don't need bribes, foul. Come on. That's what Sneaky gets for. All right, there we go. Solid hit there by the Ogres. Well, are we actually going to go get this ball? Anytime? Bueller? Bueller? Uh, no, no one's going to go get the ball. I'm going to pick on the sneaky get. Nope, missed him. Of course he missed him. All right. I would have taken both down if you rolled it. Absolutely would have taken both down just to kill the bastard. All right. So who's our star play today? Yep, that's not who you think it is. Yep, someone completely different. All right, so here we go. More hitting, more punching. Believe it or not, the Sauruses have survived. 
Two turns! Quit cheering! It's only two turns! We got plenty more games of beatings, fistings, and throbbings to do around here. Alright, push me sidestep! But it didn't work, did it? Let's take a look here at the person here. Yep! You're seeing that right? Strength three! He is indeed strength three. He's only AG three though, but he is strength three skink. Jerring for gerbils. Alright, is that is that like fishing for them? Does anyone want them? I don't know. Like we said, it's half like grass. Stole one of your frogs, he did. Yeah, he might have. It's, it's a far superior frog. Alright, push me, push you. Well, we'll shove this guy around here a little bit. Doesn't really achieve anything, but shoves him around here. So that is a lot of concentrated firepower. Meanwhile, two dice into the noble. It does indeed get the pow. And there he goes. Nobody makes me bleed my own blood. Nobody. Little light rain, little light blood. That's what the fans want to see. Yep, indeed. Nope, nope, nope. Maybe they don't want to see it. Oh, tough city. Yeah, all right. Ogis, counterattack here on turn two. Yep, we're only turn two. Thanks to the Blitz. Solid hit. Again, the Saurus is remarkably intact in this game. And there it is. Your first bonehead. He's been overdue for that one. He finally gets this here. All right, now it's time for the blip. Where the fuck are you going, Sunshine? No, seriously, where the fuck are you going? Well, he missed, so what was the point again? I'd love to know what the point was. All right, two dice, push me, fuck you. That still doesn't work. Come on. Time for a true display of skill. I don't know what the hell that's going on over there. They're just dancing away like it's Moscow. Okay, luggage. Turn three. There's just a bunch of KOs and the odd injury. So the carnage has begun, but uh, we can see more. Uh, I don't disagree. We can see more. Come on, lads. Let's get those numbers up. It's only turn three. Let's get these numbers up here. All right. Solid push. Yay. Push. Well, don't worry. He's still on his phone. Not like he noticed anyway. It's like some of those people walking down the street. Not that they fucking noticed they're on the phone as they walk through traffic. Oh, you've seen that before. All right, well, here's the useful Crooksaw. Gets a nice little hit, takes him down. Doesn't move, but it does take him down. And there it is. Yep, ball carrier. That's the ball carrier. Yep, the easy play. One and nines it. Down he goes, and so much for that fucking idea. Yeah, like I said, strap yourself in for a beer. This might be a drinker. All right, turn three for the Ogres. Big punch. AV7, ladies and gentlemen. We're back to this nonsense again. Oh, sit down. Stop trying to look it up the middle of the game. This is the problem. Yeah, you should really be telling your big guys, keep your phones on the damn bench. No, they bring them on the field every time. There we go. Solid fist. Saurus is down. Not dead. Again, if right now if you're Eric's, you'd be amazed at this. Push me. Fuck you. Well, now you've moved the middle of the ball. What the fuck was that supposed to achieve? Well, there we go. Bright tackle. The ogre goes going in there. Guards the football. Fine. Now, power and noblet. Can you actually get the ball? Well, he makes the dodge rear L. Remember, he does come built with dodge. And there's the shadowing. He's not getting away. Yes, shadowing. It actually does something. There it is. He wasn't getting away. There it is. Bye bye. Better alive. You are coming with me. Now the pain begins, lads. Now indeed the pain does begin. Yes, bravo. Just feel those nipples. All eight of them. And meanwhile, another solid hit in the ogre. Takes him now. Now this is unlike the last time where we just saw an ogre team just wiped from the pitch here. They're all back here. And they've stayed better than ever. Where? All right, charges in. Here we go. Three die blitz and the poor is in Nobler. Takes the poor bastard down. Sends him flying. <laughs> Only a stun, little wizards, little nizzards. Don't worry, it might be one of these games here. Oh, sit down. Now the Crocsaw. Nice timing, Fidel. Now the Crocsaw, of course, is boneheaded. Of course he is. Sidestep. Well, so much for firing that one up there. Oh, well, so much for that idea. But easy peasy, he's got the ball. Didn't care about the tackle zones, and off he goes. Set down! All right, Ogre's not moving here. All right, two dice over there. Solid punch, 10-4. Would you believe he still has all the Sauruses on turn four? This has never happened all fucking season. 
This is a this is a brand new Eric's apparently this game. All right, charges in. Two dice. Nice roll. What a nine. Gets it on the repechage though. There it is. Solid it. Solid takedown. And again, AV7, ladies and gentlemen. AV7. Yeah. Uh, well, Paratichi moving in there. He's trying to put up a screen with a diving tickle. Set down. No one asked you. Well, there we go. Chain of boneheads all up and down the field. But there we go. Another solid hit. Solid takedown. The Saurus has continued to survive. I don't understand it either. I must be watching the wrong game. This is clearly not the luggage we've seen all season. All right. Solid fist. Solid takedown right there. All these thunking caps. Yeah, that's what you call it. A thunking cap. Not a thinking cap. <laughs> All right, power and jump up. Easily makes the dodge. Three dice, and he gets the power of the diving tackle. Well done, lad. Well fucking done. Beautiful. Shut up and take my money. He did indeed take your money. That star player certainly earned his pay this game. Luggage, of course, continue to move along there. Crooksaw again. You know, he must be taking lessons from Cord. He's been just as useful. All right, easy dodge. Makes around there. Is he going to hand the ball off? Yes, he is. Gets it. No problem. <laughs> Stand firm, fuck you, we're not moving anywhere, Twinkle Tits. And there we are, turn five. Yes, indeed, turn five. Can the Ogres rescue the situation? Remember, they had a blitz to start this, and they created the poor bastard when they threw him. It was a great plan. Shame about the landing. That was terrible execution on the landing. All right, two dice here. They're still trying to kill the bastard. Yep. It's a skink that doesn't have dodge. Go figure. Yeah, well, technically he's not a skink. He's a frog. We all know that. All right. Meanwhile, over here. Solid hit. Solid punch. And the Sauruses continue to survive. Do you hear the voices too? Fails the break tackle though, because of course he does. Rail to one, sir. Would you like to try it again? Yes, he does. There we go. Run, you little bitch. Run. Come on. Get there. Oh, he got there. All right. Punch the butt cheeks. Yeah, he definitely got there, all right. Full strength, right into a gerbil. Brilliant, lad, brilliant. Well, that means they're scoring it. Beautiful, up one to nil. It's delicious, isn't it? What do you have to show for it? Well, quite a lot here, but don't worry. This is Ogres, and this is Yorick. So, yep, your confidence. Well, confidence is high. Only casually so far. We got one big one there. Meanwhile, a couple of these poor lads. Ironically, both the diving tackles. The people who can most deal with the skinks. So, pretty surgical. But don't worry, he's got another. He always brings them in sets of three, apparently. That is Yorick's strategy this season. Bring things in sets of three. Women... Drugs, bottles of liquor, and of course, noblies. They always bring them in sets of three. The Ogres, of course, are going to set up for a bit of punching. Well, they've got three tails to punch before they need to go and high tail this player down the field here. And picking up the ball should be easy peasy, happy squeezy. Right? Right? Well, we'll see. All right, there we go. Easy kick on the sidelines there. Everyone gets a reroll. Beautiful. Well, that just helps the Ogres, doesn't it? Now they've got two re-rolls to play with. And, of course, two re-rolls here for the luggage because the luggage hasn't really needed them. Okay, not quite true. The Crux has needed them, but, oh, he's just wasting them. All day, all night, Marianne. Who the fuck do you think he is, Superman? All right, let's get it started in here. All right, Soros takes a punch. There he goes. Clinch the butt cheeks. Yeah, yeah, there we are, finally. It's been overdue, we've all been expecting this all fucking day, but yeah, there it is, glass jaw of the Saurus. Good night, sunshine, have a good day. This might be the end of the Sauruses. Especially he can do what he does best here, remove them. Kind of like that. 
Now, amazingly so far, it's only a Coyote Elias stun. That's kind of the miracle so far. It's only a Coyote Elias stun. Normally, sources are in a lot worse shape. So, right now, I'd be honest. If you're Eric, you accept that, you'll take it. You know, it's not as bad as it normally is. So far. Well, let's hope we're not jinxing it here. And meanwhile, you can see here the ogres plow the road. They're going to go in here full speed ahead just in case. Maybe have a person scoring position that's an ogre. Big fist, big takedown there. Nah, never mind. This is Yorick we're talking about there. <laughs> no, it's not happening. Well, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. We'll see. Now, here, let's see what the skinks can actually do here. I can always imagine an ogre buying diving tickle. Wouldn't that be a skill to buy? So if you had jump up, even funnier. All right, charges in. Two dice. Timber! Down the ogre goes. Are oh, we going to foul? Please say yes. Fouling's all right. Uh, we've got a sneaky get here, so that's his job, right? Come on. Hello! The target's here. Hello! Fuck. Don't you hate when a player doesn't do its job? Oh, I do too, there. All right, Ogres. Well, turn seven. They do have two rerolls here. So, yeah, they can just casually afford to go block, block, blocky, block, block. It's a lot of blocks, isn't it? I mean, well, solid it into the crooks, takes them down. And again, so far, we're seeing a high survival rate that we're not normally used to seeing here for the luggage. The Ogres not pressing too hard there. Well, they are moving the lad into a better firing position. Meanwhile, this young, sprightly lad here is going to go and get tucked in. Come on, one more. One more! What? Never mind. Oh. Oh, I can see so many ways this is going to go wrong suddenly. Tell me I'm wrong. Doesn't he need to be there? It's true, right? He needs to be there. I'm not seeing it wrong. Okay, yeah, target, but you see no red bullseye. I don't know. Well, we could always smear something into the paint. Where the fuck are you going? So let me get this straight. The person that needed the GFI didn't. The other person did a whole ton of them. Okay. Fine. Ow! They're all dead! Just coyote. Stop exaggerating. But there, there we go. Mighty Blow gets rid of another skink. I don't know. It's, it's not bad for Eric. He's got no reserves left, but that, that's normal for him, isn't it? I mean, well, we still have two reserve noblers sitting there ready to go and be of service to you. Well, at least service to somebody there. All right. Luggage, of course, remaneuvering here on turn eight. They are not letting this bastard score. Yep, they can see it. What he was thinking, add it to the ogre and go score. Oh, no, you're not. You're not doing that anytime. Well, maybe he is. Who knows? I've seen Stranger. I, I, have you watched the broadcast recently? They, they get pretty strange, all right. Uh-oh, here we go. Cage dive! Too nice. I told you to move him. I did tell you. But guess what? Now he's loaded. Sigh. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Yep, he's loaded the ogre cannon. He has indeed loaded the ogre cannon. All right, here we go. Solid it. ha <laughs> Right, there it is, the throw! What? No! What? No! No! Ah, no! Ah! Yep, great throw, once again, terrible landing. Yep, that is it, right now. One to nil is your halftime score. This halftime, of course, will be brought to you by Eric's Press Gang Services. Remember, they'll take all your semen. Eric's Press Gang Services. Look, they pay good money. Well, there we go. And, well, as you can see here, they've actually done something. I approve. I do indeed. Yep, Havling Chef steals three rerolls. He got three. Yeah, are we sure this is Elvin Grass? Well, he survived landing, and, yep, notice, not a single player recovered. So, as you can see here, the luggage, well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's all they got. Nine players, no reserves came back. 
Don't worry, same happened for the Ogres. They didn't get a KO back either. So there we go. Now, sorry for the most exciting event in Blood Bowl and the kickoff you actually possibly get. Let's get it started in here. All right, there, the blood run free. Well, it's not been much of a slaughter, has it? No, not really. Considering the nature of these two teams, it's... I, let's be honest. It, it's an enjoyable game, but we're kind of disappointed on the lack of blood lost and bloodshedding going on. See what I mean? AV7, mighty blow. Nothing. Run, cowards! And now he's going to go lock this one up. Great. Wonderful fucking timing, Arcel. All right, here we go. Two dice. Takes the Saurus down. Sends them flying. Normally, I would say it's AV9. He should be fine. But we've gotten to know this luggage quite well over the season. So the fact the Sauruses are pretty much all standing, with the exception of the KO, is outright bizarre at this point. It's like he suddenly has realized the key is armor. You know that? Tell them they're AV7, then apparently they're just fine. Just like everything else seems to be. Alright, Nobbler moves long. Yeah, I remind you, 85 for the Nobblers. I think there's one here with AV4. Record I've had is an AV3 Nobbler. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> when he survived a hit, it was amazing. <clears throat> Alright. So, what's the plan? What? I, 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 would you make up your fucking mind? Bob and weave, you fool! Jesus Christy. Alright! Luggage. They're up still 1 0. That is kind of helping right now. Big push me. One die. He got it. He did get it. Risky business, that one there. Remember, it is 11 on 9. The luggage are defending with 9. Boy, are they helping this works. All right, solid hit, solid fist, down he goes. Oh my. And he manages to crash the cage. Of course, Nobbler's in the back, he's not too worried. See, this is easy to get around. Very easy to get out of. All right, makes the power of drop up, gets around there. Where the fuck are you going, Arcel? Keep the tip, I don't know. It's a fun set of skills he's got. Yep, very long legs, leap, all that. Yep, that is the frog. He's not a skink, he's a frog. You gotta get that right. He is an actual slain player. Slain, slain, whatever. This is why T Squared is accusing him of theft at this point here. Side step! Well, it's still alive, because of course he is. Crap! Again, th this is the blood BBPN here. AV7's the new 10. We've all seen this all season so far. No deeds this time. All right, Noblet runs over here, gets parked in behind. Meanwhile, the Ogres, again, casual fisting. Well, he decides to re-roll that. Well, that's a precious re-roll, I hate to admit. I'm kind of wondering why, and then you go, that's why there's nothing else screening the corner. He's got no choice. He kind of has to re-roll that. Oh, boy. Oh, hell no. And again, only a stun. Uh, it's remarkable how durable they've been this game here. Eh? I'm just going to keep observing that. Oh, there we go. Dun, dun, dun. Ding dong! Right, Avon calling, apparently. Oh, that, that, was, that was not good. That was not good at all. Oh, well, it's a removal the old-fashioned way. Yes, lots of alcohol. That's a great removal. All right, solid hit, solid takedown. Knocks him over here. Now, are we going to skink it? see another skink cage dive? Probably, actually. We have seen Eric's has got no fear of a skink cage dive. It might even work, too. But, nope, this time he's just going to go for the corner. All right, two dice. Has to reroll that one. Well, he's got six rerolls to spare. And there we go. He got him. Woohoo! <laughs> Yep, that is a huge fucking KO at this juncture. A massive KO there. And they're going, absolutely, no, it's not dead. Jesus Christ. But yeah, that had to hurt at this point. That really had to hurt. Oh, come on. Really? You have no soul, sir. Bang, 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 bang. What the fuck did that Nobler do to you? That should have been five dice, not three. Well, well, three was enough. Down goes another innocent Nobbler. That is suddenly a big change of t Oh, oh, fuck off. Yep, worst time to bonehead, lad. Absolutely worst time for him to bonehead. Great. Well, I hate to say it, the ball needs to run here. 
No, I'm, I'm not joking. The ball needs to go here. It can't stay there very much longer. All right, solid fisting. He gets the skeek, sends him flying. That's what he wanted. Get over here! Except it's stunned. Well, at least it's slightly... Oh, come on. Yep, Bonehead re-rolls it. He's down to no re-rolls. He's now going to load him into the cannon. Here we go! Fortune doesn't favor fools. Not today. Just not fucking today, is it? Yeah, you can hear the screams from here. Oh, for not for three. Yeah, not for three. He cannot fucking land this game. All he's looking for is a four. That's all he's looking for. He can't even find that in his pants anywhere. Wow. Those are mighty big pants. All right. Well, solid hit right there. And the bleeding will continue until the morale improves. Oh, there's a skull. Well, he's got five left over. Yep, remember, he stole three. He stole three. So, yeah, the luggage have got all the rerolls they think they need. God help you. Oh, dear. Bye-bye. Oh, well, it's only a stun right there. So, but that will buy indeed time. Now, the lucky skink. I said the lucky skink. Yay. Or not. Oh, oh, just not. Oh, this ball might stay here a while. All right, ogres have a chance to recover this, but they have to somehow. You're not helping. None of you are fucking helping. I will hunt you down wherever you're hiding, and I will eliminate you. I am, I am justice. And there it is, the diving tackle, and he gets him. Diving tackle, he got him, he indeed got him, and you saw that, didn't you? Not one, not two, yep, three straight fucking boneheads. Triple one, not a successful die roll, all turn. All bad, everything wrong. Timber, and down he goes, luggage, definitely a bought a turn. And yep, there's the load of failure. This just goes on and on, it seems like, yeah. All right, well, at least the luggage are getting to move players anyway here. All right, let's see what the luggage can do for you. Well, they've got a plan. Two dice, solid it. Takes down Captain Hurricane. Oh, dear. Well, he's just stunned anyway there. All right, tip, pick up the ball. Easy peasy, have we squeezy? He's got the ball. There he goes. Vault play in effect. Run, bitch. Run. And the Ogre's finally in a turn! Yay! Ogre's finally in a turn! Turn 13! It's kind of like 12 didn't count. Oh, sit down! No one asked you! Oh, fuck me. No! No! The horror! The horror! Yep, shadowing and tripped him. Yep, tripped him up nicely. Ah, rolled a one. Again. Again. And meanwhile, the boneheads just keep on coming. You are so small. It's funny to me. That crocs ain't going anywhere. Well, well, not that he has to go anywhere. That, that, so he just doesn't really care, does he? Luggage, turn 13. Enjoying an unusual sensation. They're winning. <laughs> I'm blood. He's winning. <laughs> he doesn't know how. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Woohoo! Stop cheering! There we go. Oh, he just wishes he was fucking dead. You! That's you! That was you who did that, you bastard! Well, the ogre just wishes he was dead. Yeah, the disco's gonna need him. He's got no job after this season. Death by inches. Yeah, that's what it felt like, lads. Death by inches, all right. A true death by inches. Strength decrease on an ogre. Ouch. Uh, don't you wish that reduced his TV? No, it doesn't work that way. It, it sometimes did in the old days. Not anymore. Don't you wish it did? All right. Well, the ogres. Not a good day, is it? Are we going to start fouling anytime soon? No. Is there any team left to foul? Not really. Notice, the luggage, there's been no change. They haven't lost a single player in this iteration. 
However, the other side, that's a whole other story. All right, luggage, solid hit, solid takedown. Meanwhile, rep greenery rails. Why not? He has spares. Gets the hit, gets the takedown. Work complete. I wouldn't say that's complete, but there's only a stun that I'll have to do there. Meanwhile, the luggage have decided they're just going to score that one in and make it 2-0. I do love that battle cry there, I gotta tell you, the Arge Argentini you gotta love how they support their firms, you, you always gotta sort of love that. Well he got a KO back, hooray! Well he got almost all his KOs back except for the same bastard, yep, he knows something, he ain't coming out to play, nope, nope, he absolutely refuses to come out and play. Alright, here we are, turn 15, let's see what happens this time, come on lads, here we go, solid kick, hey, reroll. Not that he fucking needed it. So, yeah, basically, this half, let's be honest, the return, acted like an AI team. I learned that they're actually winning. Yes, eight re-rolls for this half. Eight fucking re-rolls is what he's had for this half. He's going to finish with a re-roll regardless of what happens. Insane, isn't it? you got to love how the dice work some days. All right, well, push me, push you there. There goes Raven, excuse me. Cutting through. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Tonight we hunt. Thanks, Kat. <sighs> Sorry about that, Yorick. Sorry about that. She stepped on your nuffle. Oh, well, here we go. Luggage on the way here. Charges. Oh, God, really? Think of the children. Oh. He lives. Nobody makes me bleed my own blood. Nobody. Yeah, he has indeed live. No problem. And meanwhile, there we go. No, not the knob. Leave the knob alone. Think of his children that he wants to have. Eventually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, been stepping on it all season, haven't they? Yeah, it feels that way so far. The Ogres, let's be honest, at this point, is still wonder what the fuck they're doing in this division. They were hooligan bound, but Scotch division sucked so bad. That, well, the Ogres are in the normal division. Absolutely where they did not want to be. So, they're having to deal with this mess. Including a luggage that's decided to actually show up and play the game. There we go. Oh, dear. Would you like to try that again? Me, me. One and nine, ladies and gentlemen. One and nine. Yes, you got to admit, the, the luck's been all over the place this game. Mostly with the luggage, though, and they can feel the nipples on that one. All right, here we go. Woo! Tonight we hunt. Yep, meanwhile, the ogres. Yep, the KO is stuck, but that has been the only crack of the Sauruses almost the entire game. That's actually the second one. A stun. Remember, these Sauruses all season, except for this game, have had glass fucking jaws. Not today, Sunshine. Not today. All right. Charges in with the ogre here. Gets the dice. Gets the push. Side stepping into the ball. He goes. Woohoo. All right. Well, the Dolphins have got no choice here. They're trying to prevent three to fucking nil. Meanwhile, makes the titchy. Makes the dodge all the way across from Walla Walla, Washington. And he made it. Where are the rest of them going? Come on, come on, lads, you can do it. You can do it. Yes, you can do it. You can indeed. Oh, well, this is this is what you call a gang bang here. Fortunately, all these lads are from the same team. It's what my sister always has to make sure. Group discount, apparently. All right, so turn 16 here. Can the luggage make it 3-0? There we go. Push me. Fuck you. That doesn't work. Oh, well, that's a survivor. Yay! Oh god, we're, ble we're blitzing with him. Sneaky git comes charging in. Do it, Ice. Rerolls it. It's just a push. Sidestep. Well, that she 
Bugger all! That are alive, you are coming with me. All right, the miracle throw! No. You fool! Ah, oh, well, we knew that wasn't going to work. There are three tackle zones. What are the odds? Then again, what were the odds of this result there? You see it. You do see it. And you didn't think that after the first half, but it did work out that way. The luggage. Find a way to make it two to fucking nil. Yeah, Eric still had dice. He had it at the end. Not only did his Havling Chef in the second half actually work flawlessly. What do you mean, check the badly hurt? What do you mean, you want to check the badly hurt there? Or the boneheads? You really want me to show the boneheads? Really? Just look at his boneheads. Yep, he fails four of four of them. Now the hurricane of hurt. You've got to look at this one here. Yep, boneheads. Sixty-six success, fourteen failures. You know, but the critical part is you wouldn't think that's so bad, except that one turn, three failures in a row. That's the turn that breaks the ogres. Like right, this is reasonable. But it's where they all show up. They almost all show up in a cluster at the worst possible time for the Ogres. That seems to sum up that game. It all happened at the worst possible time. Every fucking time, I swear. Yeah, it's just one of those games. Especially like the Halfling Chef. Totally fails the first half. Perfection the second half. I blame Wolfowl. Who doesn't? Anyway, thank you all there for tuning in. It's your support that makes the channel all possible there. Who knows, you might see me on late, later on tonight on a live game. I haven't got it arranged or confirmed. That's a better word for it there. But if it happens, we'll see if the vampires can find a new way to suck. True story. Nuffle, bless your dice.